Hello. Uh, for those that don't know me, I'm Justin Irwin. Uh, I am an FAA Part 107 uh, licensed drone operator. Uh, today I am going to be showing you a kind of custom modified uh, payload release system for the Altel Evo 2 Pro, or any of the Altel Evo 2 platforms, but this is on my Pro. Um, it was originally for a DJI uh, Mavic 2, I believe, um, but uh, we've modified it a little bit to fit the uh, Altel since there weren't any good solutions available uh, on this platform. So, uh, to give you a quick rundown, it just kind of straps on the top. That's a rubber band there. Uh, you have a power and control mechanism here little on off switch a charging port on the bottom you have a single pin release and a, a light sensor that i have hooked up onto the bottom landing light of the altel i guess um on the mavic it can fit onto one of the prop lights but without uh, some extensions to the wiring that wasn't possible here this however seems to work okay just to give you a quick uh, demonstration here. See? Okay. All right, I'm trying to operate everything one-handed here with the camera and the controller trying to do this as safely as possible. All right, spin up the props. That worked well. We have liftoff. We'll take it up a little ways. We are able to lift. All right, she is hovering there pretty steady. This is only about uh, 145 grams at the most, maybe 150 with the, the uh, cabling. I have to say overall, I don't know how much the added weight is with the whole drop system, so I'll measure that later. All right. So let's move this over a little bit into soft ground. So I don't want to drop this onto the concrete. Ooh, that sways a lot while moving. Not sure what effect that's going to have on the drone, but definitely want to be careful and it drops good stuff okay we got her up to about 400 feet now it's gonna be the real test here she got up there she flies around okay with it I'm not too worried about it uh, when you're moving uh, laterally you really want to fly with a slow hand here wow 